Artificial intelligence AI, has become increasingly prominent in our daily lives, from virtual assistants on our smartphones to automated decision-making systems used in healthcare, finance, and criminal justice. While AI has the potential to revolutionize many industries, there is growing concern about its potential to perpetuate discrimination and bias. In this essay, we will examine the discrimination problems of AI, their causes, and potential solutions. Discrimination by AI can take many forms. One example is facial recognition software that has been shown to be less accurate for people with darker skin tones. This means that people of color are more likely to be falsely identified as suspects in criminal investigations or denied access to services that use facial recognition technology. Similarly, automated decision-making systems used in hiring or loan approval can also perpetuate discrimination by using historical data that reflects past biases, resulting in unequal outcomes for certain groups. One of the causes of AI discrimination is biased data. AI algorithms are trained on large datasets, and if these datasets are not diverse and representative, they can perpetuate historical biases and discrimination. For example, if an algorithm is trained on a dataset that contains mostly images of white faces, it may not perform as well on images of people with darker skin tones. This is because the algorithm has not been trained on a diverse enough dataset to recognize and accurately classify different skin tones. Another cause of AI discrimination is the lack of diversity in the teams that develop and test AI algorithms. Research has shown that diverse teams are better at identifying and addressing biases in algorithms, but the tech industry is still dominated by white men. This lack of diversity can lead to blind spots and biases that are not recognized until after the algorithm has been deployed. So, what can be done to address the discrimination problems of AI? One potential solution is to improve the diversity and representativeness of the datasets used to train algorithms. This can be done by ensuring that datasets are more diverse in terms of race, gender, age, and other factors. It is also important to ensure that the data used to train AI is not biased in itself, for example by removing data that reflects past discrimination or excluding variables that are correlated with race or gender. Another solution is to increase the diversity of the teams that develop and test AI algorithms. This can be done by actively recruiting people from diverse backgrounds and providing them with the resources and support they need to succeed. It is also important to ensure that diverse voices are heard and that everyone on the team feels comfortable raising concerns about potential biases or blind spots. Transparency is also an important factor in addressing the discrimination problems of AI. Companies that develop and deploy AI algorithms should be transparent about how their algorithms work what data they use, and how they are making decisions. This can help to build trust with users and make it easier to identify and address potential biases. Another important solution is to regularly audit and test AI algorithms for bias and discrimination. This can be done by testing the algorithm on a diverse range of inputs and monitoring the outcomes for different groups. If the algorithm is found to be perpetuating discrimination or bias, it can be modified or retrained to address these issues. It is also important to recognize the limitations of AI and the potential for human oversight. While AI can be a powerful tool, it is not infallible, and there will always be cases where human judgment and intervention are necessary. For example, in criminal justice, AI can be used to help identify potential suspects or to prioritize cases, but the final decision about whether to prosecute someone should still be made by a human judge. In order to fully understand the discrimination problems of AI, it is important to examine some specific examples. One notable example is the use of predictive policing algorithms in law enforcement. These algorithms use historical crime data to predict where crimes are most likely to occur in the future, and are used to help allocate police resources. However, research has shown that these algorithms can perpetuate existing biases and result in disproportionate policing in certain neighborhoods, which can lead to further discrimination and harassment of marginalized communities. Another example is the use of automated decision-making systems in healthcare, such as algorithms used to triage patients or to identify those at risk of certain conditions. These algorithms can be biased if they are based on historical data that reflects past biases, 
or if they do not take into account the full range of patient characteristics. This can result in unequal healthcare outcomes for certain groups, perpetuating existing health disparities. The discrimination problems of AI can also have serious consequences for employment and economic opportunity. Automated decision-making systems used in hiring, for example, can perpetuate biases based on race, gender, or other factors. This can result in qualified candidates being overlooked for jobs, perpetuating existing employment disparities. Similarly, automated loan approval algorithms can perpetuate discrimination based on factors such as race or zip code, making it harder for marginalized communities to access credit and build wealth. One of the challenges in addressing the discrimination problems of AI is that the algorithms used are often opaque and difficult to understand. This is particularly true for deep learning algorithms, which can be highly complex and difficult to interpret. This makes it challenging to identify and address biases in these algorithms, and can lead to a lack of trust in their outputs. One potential solution to this challenge is to develop methods for explaining how AI algorithms work, and for identifying the factors that are most important in their decision making. This is known as explainable AI, XAI, and it has the potential to increase transparency and trust in AI algorithms. However, developing XAI methods can be challenging, particularly for complex deep learning algorithms, and further research is needed in this area. Another potential solution is to improve the diversity and inclusivity of the AI industry itself. This can be done by actively recruiting people from diverse backgrounds, providing support and mentorship for underrepresented groups, and creating inclusive work environments. It is also important to recognize the value of diverse perspectives in AI development and testing, and to prioritize diversity and inclusion as a core value of the industry. In addition to these solutions, it is important to recognize that the development and deployment of AI algorithms should be guided by ethical principles. This includes principles such as fairness, transparency, and accountability, as well as a commitment to minimizing the potential harms of AI. For example, AI developers should be aware of the potential for their algorithms to perpetuate existing biases, and should take steps to ensure that they are not doing so. One way to ensure that AI is developed and deployed in an ethical manner is to establish clear regulatory frameworks. In recent years, there has been increasing interest in regulating AI, particularly in areas such as facial recognition and predictive policing. Regulators can play an important role in setting standards for the development and deployment of AI, and in ensuring that these technologies are used in ways that are consistent with ethical principles. In conclusion, the discrimination problems of AI are a complex and multifaceted issue that require a range of solutions. These solutions include improving the diversity and inclusivity of the AI industry, improving the diversity and representativeness of the datasets used to train AI algorithms, increasing transparency and accountability in AI development and deployment, and establishing clear regulatory frameworks for AI. By addressing these issues, we can ensure that AI is developed and deployed in a way that is consistent with ethical principles and that minimizes the potential for discrimination and bias.